Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard earned money on Madden packs? Look no further than my sponsor, MMO EXP, for the cheapest and most reliable muck coins on the market. And don't forget to use code FURDY at checkout for 5% off. I really cannot believe I'm making this video right now, but Johnny Manziel is back in Madden. He's back in Ultimate Team, and this card has potential to be the best non hot route master QB in the game right now. He has a real chance. We don't know his release yet. We're going to test it out in practice mode in a second, but 89 speed. 88 acceleration, good accuracy stats with my strat card, 92 throw power, 6 foot 210 with an 88 juke move, 91 ball carry vision, which doesn't really matter, 84 carry is really nice, 92 COD with an 86 break tackle. This card should be a lot of fun to use. He's going to be very mobile, can make guys miss, has good carrying, and of course does get the standard non-hot route master QB abilities. Also does get human joystick, probably wouldn't use that, but does get, you know, gunslinger and gift rack, probably the best and meta setup right now. If you're not using a hot round master qb and for his two aka x factors he does get escape artist and run, and running gun both for three ap probably not worth it team cams obviously only browns but let's hop into practice mode let's see what johnny football's release looks like and let's hop into some gameplay man i am so excited okay so i did go on mud.gg and i looked at johnny's release he has a traditional two which is the same release as terry bradshaw i'm um, still i i you know just based off using quarterbacks this year Andrew Luck is still going to end up being your best pocket QB that doesn't get hot route master. If you want to move a little bit, Johnny's going to be solid. Johnny's going to be right up there with Geno and Josh Allen um, as far as guys that don't get the ability. Uh, if you want to be a, like super elite runners, I guess I guess Johnny's more of an elite runner than both um, both Geno and Josh Allen. So I would probably end up putting him like with Vic. I think Vic's the best mobile QB if you want a mobile QB with a left-handed release. That actually has a better release. Slinger 1 is still better than whatever Johnny has right here, traditional 2. So if you if you can use a lefty, it's either Vic or Johnny. Vic or Johnny, depending on righty or lefty preference or just name preference as well. Um, they're they're going to be your two best mobile, like read option, speed option, quarterbacks. Um, you know, that also you get Gunslinger as well as Gift Wrap. So do like Johnny football. Let's hop into the gameplay and let's see if Johnny can throw some dots, man. The shout out for today's video goes to my man Bang for commenting the emoji on the last video. And of course, for this one, if you want a chance to be shouted out in the next one, let's comment the money emoji. And if you are in the 50% of people who watch the videos who are not subscribed to the channel, let's change that right now. Hit that subscribe button, turn those notifications, hit the like button, and let's get right into the gameplay. All right, here we go. Johnny Menzel rocking the green and white. And dude, I still cannot believe Johnny Menzel is in Ultimate Team right now. I really cannot believe it. We start get start here with a little bit of wing slot action from uh johnny manzel we got to make him respect the run game a little bit then we can start getting a little bit more creative down the field and things like that um we'll start running some mesh here flat little flat wheel concept also the drag going see if we get something going here we should have that open right there easy easy little uh swerve inside for the first down um but yeah johnny manzel so far so good obviously just two easy throws and you know the, the plan for these videos is always to just to try to get I try to get three possessions uh, per video and try getting it out as fast as possible for you guys so you guys can know if you want to buy the card or not and kind of see him in action. But I kind of really gave you a lot of my thoughts about Johnny. Uh, Juke there. We got a little Juke in us. Oh, don't, don't fumble. Don't fumble. No, do not fumble, Johnny. There we go. You do get a hit stick there as well. Having that good carrying does bail you out a little bit. But um, he should be tired. He's not even tired. It's actually pretty insane. Um, but I kind of gave you my thoughts on Johnny Manziel. I think he's going to... As far as the best mobile QBs in the game right now, and the reason people say... Justin Fields has better stats than Vic. Justin Fields is this, Justin Fields is that. Justin Fields has 53 carrying. So as a mobile quarterback, you have to just use him on conservative. And to me, using a mobile quarterback, what's the difference between Justin Fields and, you know, Geno Smith at that point? If you're on conservative, it makes no difference really what you're doing. We're trying to go to the bomb here to Johnny or to Odell. Odell to Johnny Manziel, man. The Browns theme team, low key going crazy. But um, yeah, those are my, that's my thoughts on that Justin Fields. And that's why I would put Johnny Manziel and Mike Vick both over Justin Fields as far as people who like have mobile play styles. Should have the flat actually here. We don't have the flat open. Um, should have. Oh, I, I fumbled. Pick it up. Somebody pick it up. Please pick, please pick it up. Elijah Barrett Tucker. Save the gameplay. ABT, save the gameplay. I love you. What is this guy playing? Though? I mean, I, I definitely had that second that second uh, into the running back. We definitely had that there. I'm just going to go to the same corner that we just went to. The corner that so would have been open there again believe it or not he's on palomalu now a very unique user and i don't have enough time to let the dig clear because of the pass rush and we're in a very not good really just not good uh scenario right now we can try double post i don't hate going double post and then streaking odell and maybe trying to get cooper cup open underneath and then maybe his user will fall to over the top that's kind of what we can hope for there he, he has to respect the streak right so we got to go right here underneath right there and johnny does get 
and under pressure inaccurate fourth and 31 not the ideals not the ideal start here um i don't know what i could really even go to the, like where he's he's kind of using over the top of our bunch right now which is just not what we're looking for it's not it's not looking good for us i'm gonna try running that same thing pass rush does continue to land on us keep bow in well mike well mike the outside guy here try to get a little bit of help but i if i can complete this cooper cup that'd be just nice to end this drive off um let me should actually we could have a open potentially a is open we do convert to get a first down wow in out okay he let oh Higby stays in bounds. Okay. We had enough time that time. And Johnny does end up throwing a dot right there. Johnny does, does end up throwing a laser. I, I don't really have that many like rollout plays. Um, I run the ball with my quarterback, but as far as plays where I'm rolling out consistently, I don't really have those. Usually just, that's just when like that's just like when the play breaks down. Kind of more like that. And Johnny, look at Paul Molly go, going crazy. Johnny Manziel. Find the end zone. Johnny Manziel touchdown. There we go. Johnny Manziel getting it done with his legs. And that's why I love a nice mobile quarterback. You know, a guy like Joe Montana, he might be able to put a post route there and a, and a quarter route there and a, and a Texas route there, but he can't he can't make a guy miss in the open field. He can't do that. He he, he can't. So, Johnny Manziel, touchdown. First drive, got a little rocky in the middle. But uh, we're going to keep pushing here with Johnny. So far, so good. Again, Gunslinger covers up a lot of the release issues. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised. I, I Sometimes they do change the release on quarterbacks. I wouldn't be surprised if Johnny Manziel is someone that they do change the release on. Okay, yes, the last opponent we were just playing, he he left the game before I could hit record. He threw a pick to Ed Reed and then left. But um, yeah, I was clicking around the database and Johnny Manziel has the same release as Joe Burrow. And people love that Joe Burrow release early game as well as CJ Stroud. People love both those cards at the beginning of the year. So now Johnny Manziel has traditional two and it's, he still is the only gunslinger traditional two in the game right now, which is, uh, you know, pretty good. We're kind of going to have to see how that plays. Um, we should actually have this over the middle. Oh, goodness, that was a dicey one. That ball looked like it floated up there. Okay, Johnny Manziel with a good dot, but I don't know about that one. That was a little dicey. A little, a little dicey ball to throw, but it's okay. The drive stays alive. Let's, let's run some double post. As we do, put Odell on the drag. It looks like he was guarding the flats pretty well. And honestly, that post in the middle was kind of bothering me. You know, it'll, I mean, not the post, you know what I mean. The, the zone in the middle. Bojack, oh, Bojack with a little spin out. Bojack, go crazy. First down, Bojacks, and we love to see that. But yeah, same release as both of those quarterbacks. And that was, if you played the game at the beginning, people love Joe Burrow. People love CJ Stroud's card. So Johnny should get that same treatment. I know we, now we have more options in this game, obviously. Get over his head. That might be a touchdown. Hold up. Whoop. Yeah, I do have jukebox on Odell Beckham as well. <laughs> I do have jukebox. I know, I know it's crazy. I know it's crazy. Let's go right back. Let's go into read option. I'm trying to get Johnny Manzo. Johnny Manzo cooking on that read real quick. Please, Aaron Donald, please don't have... Oh, he's already putting a guy out there. You might know something's coming here. If he do not chop, if he do not chop, Johnny Manziel, second rushing TD of the gameplay, Johnny Manziel, touchdown. Okay, okay, Johnny, okay, Johnny. Man, this card's, this card's gonna be fun, man. This card is going to be so much fun to use, bro. Look at him, little keeper, okay? Go crazy, Johnny, okay, man. And the one-handed, okay. Dude, this card's gonna be so much fun, man. All right, here we go. We got our final drive with Johnny Manziel. And honestly, I don't really have a final opinion yet on his release. I, I think it feels fine. I do have Gunslinger on him, but I, I remember, like, I like CJ Stroud's release. I, I like those releases. So, I, you know, giving that release Gunslinger, as far as the final report goes, I think I'm, I think I'm leaning, giving him five star for animations. I really am leaning that way right now. Getting the ball out nice and quick. Getting the ball out easy. And I'm, I've been used to using the lefty for a while and, you know, my timing feels the same. Everything feels good. Like, I, I'm easily adjusted here uh, with Johnny Manziel. We're going to try that same corner ride that beat him last time or we're going to have the flat to Higby, one or the other. Um, let's see which one he... Oh, first quarter's over. Okay. But, um, yeah, I, I like the release, man. And he's our first Gunslinger traditional. Two of you liked early game Burrow. If you liked early game CJ Stroud, you're going to like Johnny Manziel. And you, maybe you could even maybe run this release. If you, like, if you like those releases so much, maybe you could even run him without Gunslinger, but I don't even do that. I probably wouldn't do that. There's no reason for you not to run Gunslinger. There is. It's only man to man. But there's no reason for you not to run Gunslinger. So use Gunslinger with traditional two. This card feels fine. Card plays great. Animations are feeling good. We should have Odell Beckham sideline. Good, good body there from Johnny, though. Put it right on. He didn't even put it near the sideline. That was actually an ideal throw from Johnny. Good pass lead. It would really suck if this gameplay ended on a fumble. It really would suck if that's how it ended. But we, we got to let Johnny go. We got we to gotta let Johnny go, man. Got to let Johnny go. Whoop. Johnny Manziel. Big guy missed. Oh, I'm going out of bounds. I'm not running to Sean Taylor. If I cut that back, it was Ed Reed. If I go straight in Sean Taylor, let me get out of bounds. Let me get out of bounds. Let me get out. And I don't actually hate the PA Reed call here. He's got one high. We should actually get... That's open. He's open. Oh, no, it's not. I got I to gotta go for the play. 
Cooper Cup touchdown, man. I mean, what can I say? What a gameplay from Johnny Manziel. Let's try to end it real quick with a nice little something, something quick, something quick, something quick. Dude, what a what a gameplay from Johnny Manziel, man. We're gonna get into the final report here, but man, this card basically what I thought he was gonna be. The only question mark on this card was the, of course, the um, the release, and he's got a good release in my opinion. So. So far, so good for Johnny, and we, I have probably, that's probably my bad. We definitely could have found the end zone. Let's get to the final report, and, uh, man, that was a fun one, man. Okay, Johnny Manziel's final report, and I'm going to give Johnny 19 stars. However, there is an asterisk. The asterisk here is that if you don't need Hot Route Master, he's five, he's 20 stars. Like, he's perfect if you don't need Hot Route Master. Hot Route Master exists in this game, so I got to knock quarterbacks down that don't get it yet. So, 19 stars, thankfully, for Johnny, but if you don't need Hot Route Master, he's 20 stars. Release with the Gunslinger felt amazing. Stats, obviously, you know, amazing. And then physicals can move, can make, you know, can do everything. Throw powers there, five stars there as well. So Johnny Manziel, a 19 slash 20 star player. If you're looking for a, you know, a mobile QB that, and you don't need Hot Route Master, he's right there with Mike Vick. Mike Vick was my favorite, but now Johnny enters that conversation. And for a lot of you guys who can't use right-handed or left-handed quarterbacks, Johnny Manziel's already with a solid release is going to be a super viable and fun option. So, uh, Johnny Manziel, can't recommend him enough. Let me know down in the comment section. You're going to be adding Johnny Manziel to your team. And as always, I'll see you boys in the next one.